Oh. Mhm. Nani? Wa Shinyanga no. Namfahamu mbunge wa Singida. Mhm. Namfahamu ndio. Okay. Inasemekana ni baba mtoto wako. Mhm. Ni kweli? Inasemekana lakini. Baba mtoto wangu ni siri yangu mimi mwenyewe. Nani? <laughs> That's too personal. <laughs> That's too personal. Ile voice note it wasn't my voice. Sikuwa mimi. Ile voice note sio yangu lakini mahojiano yalikuwa yangu. Mhm. Na ndio maana nilivyouliza kuhusu voice note nikasema sijui kitu kama hicho kwa sababu it wasn't me. Okay. Mm. Wapi? Hapana. Ndio. Sana tu. Oh, na kwa mtu. Hapana. Nishawai. Basi nikaumia tu lakini sasa nilikuwa nishampenda na mpenda hivyo mm-hmm. basi hapana sasa we mbona sikuelewi mara hii king sasa mimi na watu wanga vile eli king usiko naye kwenye mahusiano lakini ndio baba mtoto wangu ya ndio baba gideon ya anaitwa gideon okay kwa kweli sijui na mheshimu sana yule mama. Mm-hmm. Yaani I really respect her kwa sababu she is so humble she is this woman ambaye ah, sijui kama anajua. Ameshakutafuta. Hajawahi. Mm-hmm. Sijawahi kuongea naye. Mm-hmm. Kwa sijui kama anajua au hajui. Baba mtoto wako anatoa huduma. Hampo kwenye mahusiano mabaya. Ya. Anatoa huduma kwa kuna kuna posti huwa na posti yale mm. uh, za kusema kwamba sisi kuna mwana wanawake wakitaka kuwa sisi na mtu kwenye mahusiano wanakuwa naye ili amzalie sijui hivyo hivyo na kitu kama yeye anamsikia mke wake na kama anaponda upande mm. wa pili ambao kuna mtu ambaye anamwona kama goldiga mm. kwake kwa sababu amezaa mm. ili mm-hmm. endelee kuchuma vitu kama hivyo mm-hmm. kwa kwa wewe unaichukulia vipi ah uh, okay to be honest being very honest in front of god mimi niliona hiyo post niliona kwenye peji za umbea ni post ambayo iliniuma sana kwa sababu so far i don't know his background sijui maisha yake sijui alishaikuwa na nani amezaa na wanawake wangapi sijui so far najua tu kwamba ana mke wake ana watoto wake na mimi na mtoto wake kwa ile post hata kama ni mwanamke mwingine aliyeza naye obviously atajifikiria kwamba ni yeye analengwa kile kitu it wasn't a, a, a very good thing na mimi nilishawahi kumwambia siwezi kujua kwa nini aliandika vile kwa sababu mimi sikuwa na elekingu sikuwa naye kwa sababu ya position yake sikuwa naye kwa sababu ana pesa au ana nini na ndo maana there is nothing nime gain kwake labda tuseme kanipa nyumba kanipa maisha mazuri kanipa nini no mimi nilikuwa naye for the love i had for him na kuzaa mtoto ni kitu ambacho tulikuwa tumepanga wote mimi na yeye unaona eh kwa hiyo ile post nilivyo niliona sikuipenda nilimwambia na kama mliona okay nilimwambia japokuwa nilikuja kumwambia too late ameshatokea ma dramas instagram ni kwa sababu by that time tulikuwa hatuongei lakini mpaka tumekuja kuongea nilishamwambia kwamba what you did is not okay kwa sababu mimi uwezi kunita gold digger na wakati there is nothing i'm gaining from you unaona eh kwa ndo niliona lakini kama aliedit yale maneno Yaani after wewe uh, no uh, before hata mimi kumwambia niliona kae naona baada ya zile Instagram waliweka walifanya nini mambo mengi akaona kabisa kwamba alichofanya it wasn't right kwa sababu mwisho wa siku the child is his yani Gideon ni ata, atabaki kuwa mtoto wake kwa hiyo ndio hivyo lakini otherwise everything is okay anamhudumia vizuri ameshaikumwona mtoto wangu wa Isaiah eh ashaikumwona ndio No, anamhudumia, anamhudumia mwanae. Inakuuma vipi ukisikia kwamba una, una wewe kama unasema unaumia yeye kuwa na mahusiano mengine like alivyosema kwamba ana mahusiano na Safari Samde kwamba ile voice inaonesha kama vile unijapenda. Yaani imeonesha kama vile bado unamhitaji mzazi mwenzako. Ndio ilivyoonesha ile voice ndio maana 
Ngoja nikwambie kitu kimoja my love ambacho watu wengi wakilewi. Kwa mtu yote ambaye ni mama hakuna mtu anayependa kukua single mother. Hakuna mtu anayependa kulea mtoto wake mwenyewe. Hata kama baba anatoa huduma kiasi gani. There is no that woman. Unaona eh? Kwa hiyo mimi mimi hapa nikiona Elkingu yuko na mahusiano na mtu yoyote tofauti na mke wake. It really hurts me. Na kwa sio kwa sababu unampenda lakini kwa sababu unaona kwamba anakuwa labda anampa yule mwanamke muda mwingi kuliko muda anaotoa kwenye familia yake na kwa watoto wake. Mzazi mm. mwenzako, kwa unajua hakuna shida. Sijui, yani unajua kuna kuna sometimes tunaweza ukaachana na mtu then hujui sababu we. Ndo mimi hapa na ili ilivyokuwa. Sijui sijui sababu mpaka leo. Labda yeye anaweza akawa anajua sababu lakini mimi sijui sababu. Sijuti. Wewe kanipa baraka ya mtoto. Najutaje sisi? <laughs> sijuti. Kitu kizuri kwake ni kipi? He is very awesome. Hana kitu kibaya. Mhm. Kwa hiyo Everything. Ah wewe unakumbuka na vile vile No wana tofauti wana tofauti lakini sio kama anakumbuka sana nao 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 kidogo na ona he's awesome unajua kwenye ukweli unasema ukweli yes. he is this man that is so sweet yani hata kama anakukosea akikuf... yani the fact kwamba akikufata tu unasahau hata kama alikukosea yani akianza tu kukuongelesha neno la kwanza yani unasahau ni this person ambaye he is very humble ni mtu ambaye Yaani hapendi kumuona mtu wake wa karibu anaumia. Hata kama atakwambia maneno ambayo hata yafanya au vipi lakini wewe hapo kasha kupooza, kasha kutuliza. Eh, yani he is this na he is the person ambaye ukiwa naye. He is very proud of you. Na hata haoni aibu kusema this is the this is the woman I love. This is what this is this. Yaani nampenda. Wewe ndio tofauti na pilipili, pilipili kwa hivyo. Tuachane na pilipili. I don't want. He is yani pilipili mimi hapa siwezi kumzungumzia tena kwa sababu ni mtu ambaye sina hakuna kitu kinachofanya sina connection naye kufanya mimi nimuongelee. Yule anaweza akawa na maisha yake na mimi yani kama alivyo na maisha yake na mimi na maisha yangu lakini mimi na Elkingu tuna bound kati yetu ambaye ni mtoto. So I can always speak about him lakini not pilipili. Kitu kikubwa kilichonichosha ni yeye kujiunga rafiki na baba mtoto wangu na kuni snitch. Yes and it's after mimi na baba mtoto wangu kuingia kwenye conflicts tukawa hatupatani then ndo akajifanya kwa yani wote wamenibwa kwenye that sector kwa sababu uwezi kumwe baba mtoto wangu uwezi kuwa na urafiki na ex wangu na na wewe ex wangu uwezi kuwa na urafiki na baba mtoto wangu mimi then eti mnasema you good friends lakini behind behind na nili my back mnakuwa mnaniongelea vibaya mnafanya nini and i get all the the things au mimi naweza nikakwambia wewe hapo labda ex wangu kuna kitu fulani kwa sababu mimi na pilipili wewe we good times kwa tuna Siliana. Kwa hiyo nilikuwa namwambia maybe kuna kitu fulani kimetokea eli kanifanyia hivi. Ya anafikisha kule anaenda kumwambia. Kwa hiyo that was too bad. Yaani yani ni kitu ambacho kimenifanya nimemchukia. Then na okay let's go. Wanajua wenyewe. Wewe ulijuaje kama wanakusema? Nilijua kwa sababu nakumbuka kuna siku mimi niliona let, let me remember niliona Instagram eh? Yeah I saw on Instagram pilipili amemfollow huyo nani lii huyo elikingu then elikingu by that time alikuwa hajamfollow back mimi nikamuuliza nikamwambia hey kwenye simu ya pilipili kwenye simu yangu mimi mwenyewe niliona yani kwa sababu nilikuwa nimemfollow pilipili nikaangalia watu walio wafollow isi inaonesha pale alio wafollow nikaona yes nikaona then mimi nikamuuliza like kwa nini umemfollow baba mtoto wangu na wakati it doesn't bring sense unajua eh you're liking his pics you're commenting it's okay sio kitu kibaya lakini unajua mimi simkatazi yeye na na baba mtu wangu kwa marafiki lakini mnakuwa marafiki in which sense mna ni include mimi kwenye maongezi yenu mnafanya nini hivyo kwao nilivomwambia vile in a very good way yeah come screenshot hizo message akamtumia ile kingu mimi na nili eli akaniambia kama hey naona unamchimba biti pilipili kuwa na rafiki na mimi sasa you can imagine yeah alijuaje kama they were not good friends baadaye nikaanza kuona na commenti na my brother man mpaka elkingu alisafiri kaenda sijui wapi amerudi kama wamemletea mpaka zawadi ya suti unaona eh 
mimi nikasema to me it was very okay yeye yeah, kuwa na rafiki kuwa na rafiki na king inaweza ikawa ni beneficial kwake lakini unakuwaje yani okay muwe marafiki lakini do not include me kwenye maongezi yenu kwa sababu wanakaa wanasimuliana eh nimemkomesha sasa hivi sijui it doesn't bring sense mi sijui wanajua wao wote wawili kama ongezi yao mm. na hizo habari wewe unazipata nazipata kwa sababu gani mimi yule pale ngoja nikwambie kitu kimoja yes. eli ni mzazi mwenzangu mm-hmm. hata sasa hivi akisikia ni call kuna hiki na hiki na hiki he tells me yes. na mimi nikisikia kwamba kuna hiki na hiki namwambia yes. unaona eh mm-hmm. kwa sababu hata juzi ameona mimi clip ya engagement mm-hmm. he told me kabisa kwamba ongera kwa kwa uchumba lakini be very careful to expose these things kwa sababu inaweza ikatokea bad luck maybe is nini nini ni hivyo. Kwa hiyo ni vitu ambavyo tunaambiana. Mimi mtu akiniambia kitu kuhusu weli, yani yani hata wewe ukiniambia hapa namfikishia namwambia. Kama ilivyo. Namwambia black and white. Same to him. Akipata taarifa kwamba kuna hiki na hiki na hiki, anakuja na niambia ni call fulani kaniambia hivi na hivi na hivi. Na hata evidence ukitaka anakuonesha. Kwa hiyo jinsi nilivyojua. I was very disappointed na nilimwambia mimi pilipili kwamba ulichokifanya sio kitu kizuri. Akaniambia like akaniambia wewe unataka unilazimishe kila mtu ambaye uongee naye awe adui yako. Nikasema sijakwambia kila ambaye siongee naye awe adui adui yako wewe. Lakini kwani wewe Eli King umemjua kupitia mimi after all these stuffs. Okay you could be good friends kwa, kwa benefits zenu na kwa faida zenu. Sio kuniingiza mimi kwenye maongezi yenu, sio kuniongea. Mhm.